Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome to my channel, Defective Ryan, and today I'm going to show you my first ever NBA Live mobile video. Today I'm going to showcase you the best card you can get for each position under 100k. Well, a budget of 100k for each card. Well, you know what I mean. Anyway, let's go with the point guard. So for the point guard, I kind of found like other decent cards, but more on, I wanted something that's offensive since I use a lot of because I use my point guard to shoot a lot of threes and even mid-range shots, so I grab the 90 overall all-star elite Kemba Walker. So let's look at Kemba's stats. Uh, there he is. We got the 90 overall Kemba Walker. So let's look at his stats. We have 92 speed, 94 agility, 90 mid-range, 88 three-pointer, 86 dunking, 85 scoring with contact, 90 on-ball defense, and uh, 94 dribbling, and 93 passing accuracy. This guy was really good back when it was uh, released. Uh, I use I use this guy a lot for like past twenty games. I think I kind of won like sixty percent of them because of this guy. He literally gave me some clutch shots. Anyways, this guy's an overall good card, and he's really good to buy if you for your uh, balance lineup or even your your start or even your starter or bench. Anyways, let's go for the shooting guard. So for the shooting guard, we're going for the most inconsistent card I've ever seen in my life but the reason why I'm still grabbing him because of his well stats yep you know who he is he is the 93 Lunar New Year James Harden now why did I still choose James Harden over the other cards well uh, look at his stats he has a 90 agility 94 mid-range 93 three-pointer which is really good 91 dunking and the 90 passing accuracy and the 92 contested shot. For me, this this is this guy is still good because I still have the 99 MVP. But you know, uh, this guy's still pretty decent as a shooting guard. This can totally fill in your starter starter role or even your bench just to bring in that uh, overall increase. Next, we ha we're going to have the uh, small forward position. So for the small forward position, we're going for the let's see. Let's see if he's still there though. Oh, so the, forgot about to check the pricing. Hurricane. Okay. Now, let's look at this. Let's look at the cards. Yeah, so, yeah, it's gonna be filled with 88 Larry Birds. I was looking for the 91 Larry Bird, but they still won't show up. I did look for one, I did see one. Maybe you can see it. Oh, crap. 93 Chris Middleton. Holy crap, you can totally get this guy for maybe this probably a uh, snipe, but I am buying it obviously um, So let's look at his stats. He has a 90 speed 93 agility 95 mid range 90 94 three-point shot 90 inside paint shot 94 passing accuracy Overall this guy's really good. Oh, it's sold, sold out anything then other than that you can still get the Jason Tatum the Look at his stats. Uh, we have an 88 speed, 89 agility, 87 mid range, 86, 86 three pointer. Overall, his stats are mediocre, but you can still get around with it. But for me, I would go look out for the 91 monthly master Larry Bird. He's still pretty decent as an overall small forward. I like his, sh I like his shot. I like his uh, shot percentages. It's pretty good. Anything that, anything than that. I guess we'll keep uh, an, eye, an eye out for that guy. Next is we're having the power forward. For the power forward, we're going for the... Hmm. Let's look at it. We all know that EA hates power forwards, so like you won't easily get a high overall power forward for, under just, for just under 100k. So let's look. Yep, you're only going to get the... Let's see it. 89 Kevin Love. So the 89, Ke 89 Kevin Love really good offensive rebounding uh decent uh post shot dunking scoring with contact 90 mid range 87 three point shot now this guy's pretty good but due to the amount like look at that you can only get these guys for me i'd still go for the if you guys can still find one uh i'd go for the 87 uh antonio davis from the venice beach event like this guy uh, he is a look at that decent point uh, inside paint shot decent post shot which is all 90s the rebounding does need a little bit of a oomph like an extra 
extra points, but you know, defense is pretty good. Overall, I don't know why his three point shot's better than his mid range. Maybe he's a. Uh, well, I wasn't. A, I was born when, I, when that guy was just playing. Jesus Christ. Anyways, next is for the center position. Now, for the center position, we're gonna. We know him. He's the snake. We have we have the 90 overall Kevin Durant. So for the Kevin Durant, again he's like a real a budget piece. He's like a budget piece for real. Kevin Durant, the center position for 100k. I think you can even get this guy for a 70k. Let's look. Yep, you can totally get this guy for cheap, for dirt cheap. He's a he's a Balanced sharpshooter. So let's look at stats. We have an 88 speed, 89 agility, 90, 93 mid range, uh, 93 pointer, 90 mid in, inside paint shot. Uh, 90. The good thing about this this center, uh, Kevin Durant, is that he has decent offensive and defensive rebounding. Like, look at that. 90 overall uh, offensive rebounding and defensive rebounding. Even the 90 passing accuracy. That's pretty good for a center. Although you know still a snake anyways that's what that uh, that is all for today uh if you want more please comment down below what you want me to do want like under let's want to bump it up for a 200k you want me down to 50k anything else and anyway the next that would be it anyways thank you guys for watching and see you in the next one